obviously we established that um, people have been preying on you. That's you know, right. there were criminals ringing you up all the time, all time. and there were people calling at your door. Do you th- can you sort of say what how these things built up? You know, how, what sort of things built up? You, you didn't used to open your mail, did you? Really? I did at first. Yeah, I did at first, and then every day I was getting ten, fifteen letters a day. And it got it got too much, it got too much. I just picked them from the uh, front door and put them on the stairs because it it got too much to open them up. Once somebody replies to an offer of saying winning the Spanish lottery and sending monies off, uh, that individual uh, will then be harassed and sent letters after letters. letters. Their details will be shared amongst other criminals, and it's not a nice term, but there's something called a suckers list, where Brian's name undoubtedly ended up on this list. So not only would have been receiving letters from the original criminals, then other criminals would have been targeting Brian. That is why, Brian, that you was receiving so many letters, and it all got too much for you, Too much it? for me. I, I just couldn't... Keep, keep up with it at all, you know. You also missed quite a lot of important things in them letters, didn't you? Yes, some some of the genuine letters that I should have opened and I missed out on, such as uh, I had a couple of checks sent to me, and we're not opening them. I'd gone back by the uh, date. Yeah. They should have been cashed into the bank, you know, put into the bank. Can you remember how much in total those, I think there were three or four checks, weren't there? Yeah, one were, one were about, uh, I think it 5,000, I think. One, one were about 5,000. Yeah, there was quite a few thousand yeah, pounds, wasn't yeah, there? Yeah. Uh, that you'd missed out missed on. Missed out on. Uh, some were honoured, some weren't. Weren't. Weren't there? Yeah. 